What's up, King Pook Edition? This is boy King Pook and I'm now reviewing the Los Angeles Rams versus the Chicago Bears. This is going to be the opening game in the 2021 season. Um, and this is going to be the first game in SoFi Stadium where they're going to be playing with fans. Last year, they, you know, they didn't have fans because of a COVID. But, um, yeah, so this, this is going to bring them. A big atmosphere, and there's a, a lot of Chicago Bears fans that I know that are going to be going to LA, and I know they do have a lot of Bears fans in Los Angeles. Good Rams, so man, but um, yeah, the the Rams are going to be looking very different this year. Um, they you know they traded away Jared Goff to the to the Lions, and and you know the Rams received um. Matthew Stafford in the trade, you know, so, um, and Matthew Stafford in 2020 season, he was, he had 26 touchdowns, 10 interceptions, and his QB rating was 96.3. Um, in 2020, their O-line was ranked 6th in the league, and then they, in sacks, they were ranked 6th. Sixth in the league, and um, but the Bears, man, their old line was you know terrible last year because we had Mr. Bisky, um, as you know, and that old line was actually terrible, um, yeah, so because you no know, um, the, the Bears decided not to pick up Mr. Bisky's fifth year option, so our bonehead general manager he signed. Andy Dalton from the Dallas Cowboys, you know, um, I mean, he couldn't find someone better, so, yeah, but, um, yeah, the Bears are 90, 94.9, and they're 20 in the league, and they were, and yards per average is 16th, and, you know, as I guess it is, they signed Andy Dalton, and he is 4 for 5 next year. Because, you know, he did not play the whole season because, you know, he was the back of quarterback. So, he had to replace, um, you know, um, Dak Prescott because of that horrific injury. So, um, he only he played four, ga four games out of five. Um, he, but he had 14 touchdowns and eight interceptions. And, um, Abe Rob in 2020, he had 120 receptions and he had a thousand two hundred fifty yards and he had six touchdowns total and um the Bears O line was terrible man they were just they were ranked twentieth in the league and they were seventeenth in sacks sacks and the Rams passing rushing were second in the league and, and um the PFSS they were fifth in the league you know um hopefully the, the David Montgomery hopefully you has to have a breakup year you know Mad Daisy you see he's like use the running game more you know I mean because you know you we hope that David Montgomery gets they use David Montgomery because um Mad Daggy just Stayed away from the running game last year, so uh, hopefully, you know, David McGurn has a breakup year this year. He has a thousand seventy and he's eighth in the league, 4.3 yards per carry. You know, so that and then the, the Rams rushing were 3.8 yards per carry, they were 91.3 yards, and they were. As I said, yards per carry third in the league, and then the do and so, but the Rams are favored to win this game by seven. So I don't trust Andy Dalton. No, um, but what I'm really looking forward to is Darnell Mooney versus Jalen Ramsey. You know what happened last year? He burned him out. He burned it, and then Jalen Ramsey heard it from Bears fans on Twitter. You know, so, man, he, so, Darnell Mooney, I hope he, 
he burns them again like he did last year. But uh, I'm gonna pick the Rams are gonna win this game. I have no, I'm I'm not. I mean my Andy Dalton. You know I don't have no faith with that guy. You know, and so um, but yeah. So let me know what you think. Leave me a comment below. Um, the 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 who's gonna win or what's the score of the game? Give me a huge thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys after the game. This is your boy King Pookie, and I'll see you guys in the next video.